What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Um, it's gonna be a quick video, y'all. I'm gonna show y'all how I get my curls and the um last couple of po post pictures that I posted. Um, it's really easy. You just need clips. Your favorite curling iron. Mine's is Conair. This is actually Danny's curling iron, but we're gonna use it today. Um heat protectant. I have she iron guard. It looks like that. You're gonna need a comb. I have a lot of combs, so I'm gonna use this one. And that's about it. Um I'm gonna throw some of this on my edges along with hairspray and Holden spritz by Fantasia. I like it. So it's all you need for this tutorial. I have this hat on because my hair is a mess under it. But it's a tutorial, so um my life is shambles. I actually did not get out of bed until three o'clock today. Cause I'm so tired. Like I got home. It was like one something. And as soon as I hit my pillow, I was dead to the world. I'm going to do one side on camera and one side off camera because it gets kind of repetitive. So I'm going to do this side and then I'm going to speed through that side. Um, first what you're going to do is spray your iron guard all through your hair. Mm -hmm. I also have a detangling brush. It helps with detangling hair. Instead of using a comb and ripping all your hair strands out. You always, when detangling your weave or your hair, period, you always start from the bottom up. Because if you start straight from the root, you're going to be ripping um, parts of your hair out. And you definitely don't want to do that. So, we're going to sheen a little bit. And the part that I start with first is my front because you guys know how that little swoop area is created. It's because I start with this and then I pin it and then go and do the rest of my hair. So, taking our curling iron, it's on the highest heat setting, which is 395 degrees. And you just go and take it. Swirl it around, make sure all that hair is in there, room. I keep swirling. I think I did a curling tutorial before, but it was, I think it wasn't waving. I forgot what it was, y'all. But, um, I think I did a tutorial before. Then, what you want to do is just roll it up. Um, don't worry about those straggly pieces. We're going to get them in there, too. But, um, yeah, was, can you teach me how to curl my hair? I'm like, it's so easy. It's so easy. To get those type of curls that I had in my hair, I'd rather use a curling iron. Some people like to use the flat iron, which is perfectly fine. But just the clinching, and I don't have time for all that, y'all. Like, I really don't. Okay. So, you want to touch it, of course. And that's when that little piece is going to end up. You're going to start loosening on that part without completely letting it go. So without letting the hair out of the barrel, you're just going to tap it a few times and get that strangly piece in there. And then what we're going to do, let's do that. I like to hold my curl without letting it drop first because it impacts the heat. Do a finger curl. I said a finger curl. A pin curl. Bam. Don't have to be perfect as long as it's wrapped around tight. I take the holding spray and do that. And that makes sure that the curl. Am I going to pin every piece? No, just my swoop part because that's the part that I need to be sha popping, you know? So, starting from the back. That was too big of a piece. We're gonna do the same thing. The same thing. Like, let me come further over this way so you guys can see what I'm doing. 
Now, have I burned myself a couple of times? Yeah, but, you know, beauty hurts. <laughs> um, okay. Now, you just want to wrap it around the barrel so it can impact that heat. And I said, guys, it's really easy. Like, it's really easy. It's really easy. Y'all always up. I'm not gonna be able to do it. Like I said. Now, because we're not using a pen, it might be hella hot, but we're gonna hold it for like five seconds. So, four or five. There you go. One beautiful curl. We're just gonna keep going all the way around. Um, these particular curls, I'm not going to take to the root because I'm not going anywhere. Um, but normally if I'm like going out and a curl is what I want, I do start my curls from the root. And I'll do another video, an updated video, showing you guys the technique. Sorry, I wasn't in frame. Now that happens from time to time. And you might get annoyed, but like me, I always get annoyed when that happens. <laughs> Cause it's like, what the hell? What the hell was that? So you're just gonna do it again. Do it, do it, do it. And we rolling. Who else is tired of that Black Beatles song? I am so sick of that damn song. Everybody, everybody played that shit out. My God, did it again. Okay, I'm gonna stop rolling it right here because I'm not doing this part, I guess. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna let it sit, and then. Five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. There you go. Um, sometimes I do them in different when your life is in shambles. Like, <laughs> I don't even know how that got up there. <laughs> but anyway, um, sometimes I do do them in different um different going different ways and that creates volume but also how I'm gonna show you how to create bigger volume is I'm gonna show you guys at the end of the video because it actually works for me um, I just would say do it before you do your leave out because But yes, yeah, so this one is going in the opposite direction. My eyes were darn for some reason. So yeah, let's talk about this freaking snow. Oh my God, I'm so over it. We got like a little teeny tiny bit of snow. And I was like, so not having it. I hate snow. My eyes watering for what? Like... <laughs> this water I don't have really I just have powder on I'll let it go bang bang if you want to you could do another one going in that same direction I don't want to grab that cone because I feel like that's going to knock everything over I promise my next video there will be background music but ow see just burnt myself um, my other phone is dead, and I haven't even really reached for that drone in like days. So, uh, next video, it won't be so quiet. Oh my god, I just did it again. Okay. 
I don't, I'll hold it on for like, I count to 10 in my head. I don't hold it on that long because, you know, let it go. Boom. This video is already 10 seconds long. I might just come back and have everything done because my phone because I share everything with my sisters and I have not yet I think I'm gonna do it next week though and they just gonna have to figure it on their own because I have 32 gigabytes I would love to use it like there's no need I just got this phone and it's already saying storage problem like I hate that damn notification but this one is going in the other direction like all of the other curls and it's not, unless you want, like, that voluminous, voluminous, voluminous um, payoff and you doing them in little direction, then that's totally up to you. Me personally, I do them in middle, like, middle, medium to large sections because I can create my own volume. Um, because, girl, I don't be wanting to be sitting around all day, which is why I never did the teeny tiny wine curl because them shits take forever yo they really take winding takes a while anyway so just think about doing like micro pieces of your hair it's annoying I was looking at my mirror to see what I was doing but I'm gonna finish this off doing the rest of that side um, I got one more piece left. When I come back, I'm going to show y'all how to create that volume. And what have you. Like I said, this is going to be a quick tutorial. Because everybody was asking me. But when y'all find out how easy it is. Y'all going to be like, oh, I could have did that the whole time. Tell him. It's easy. Sometimes that might happen, but it won't mess up your curl. Just kind of put it back in place without burning yourself. Then I just kind of let them sit, but this is this side. I'm not going to finger them out yet. I'm going to do this side, and then I'll be right back to y'all. Bye. Well, see you in a minute. <laughs> y'all I'm back so I'm done both sides of my hair now what I'm about to do is take this it was like a little travel package 24 hour edge tamer I usually use um gorilla snot but I don't have time for my edges to be white I mean to be rock fucking hard right now so yeah so let's take this comb Get those baby sorry y'all my sister was calling my phone and the recording stopped she doesn't even fucking want anything um anyway I always put um oil in the middle but I'm going to take these pins out now and see how that fell I'm going to leave that my real hair pinned, but I'm going to show you guys what I do. I flip my hair. Flip it back. Bring it this way. Valium. Okay, girl. Like. Oh, hey, girl. Like. <laughs> um, yes. Oh, my God. I love when I curl my hair, but it's just such a fucking task. And... Oh my god, I don't be feeling like doing it. Like, I don't. Get real hair. It's gonna fall right in place. Sometimes I take my comb and do that. Um, 
just to make it look, you know, somewhat. So yeah, guys, I just take some oil, not oil, pink oil sheen. And that's really how I curl my hair. Um, the only difference with this is I didn't curl it this time. But it still gives the payoff that like I did curl it. I mean, pin it a little bit. The curl just would have been a little bit more tighter if I would have pinned it. So, you guys, we're almost at 100 subs bless like oh my god so you know once i get to 100 subbies i will be doing a giveaway um hopefully it's by christmas so it could be like a giveaway slash christmas gift for you guys i don't know but um yeah that's how i get these curls she popping or whatever and sometimes if my real hair doesn't like to freaking cooperate i just spray some holding spray on it I tie it down and go on about my day but um yeah no, that's it that is done with this tutorial i love you guys make sure you like comment and subscribe to my videos share my videos as well um let's get the family built let's get it shop hopping you know i love you guys see you guys next video bye